the emergence of a new coronavirus variant in the United Kingdom has now sparked concerns across the globe. Owing to the growing scare and tensions, many nations have now begun genome sequencing of genes of COVID-19 positive samples. In India, the National Task Force on COVID-19 said that as part of prospective surveillance, 5% of positive cases from all states and union territories will be tested for whole genome sequencing to check for the presence of this UK strain. More than 50 samples of UK returnees are currently under sequencing at designated laboratories. All passengers who arrive from the UK between November 25th and December 20th are currently being tracked by surveillance units. The move comes weeks after the UK found a variant with an unusually high number of changes, including some that are believed to make the virus over 50% more transmissible. Japan, Spain and Canada have joined several other countries to report this new UK variant. Australia too has reported the first few cases of this new variant along with the UK. Two other coronavirus variants have also emerged across Nigeria and South Africa. Meanwhile, the United States has the most number of coronavirus cases in the world as of now, but when it comes to sequencing cases to check for genetic changes, it lags at an alarmingly low rate. With more than 18 million cases officially reported, only 0.3% of the total number of cases have been genetically analyzed for variants. Now with this, the U.S. ranks 43rd worldwide in virus sequencing. And according to the latest data... Australia and New Zealand top the charts for most number of sequencing to check for coronavirus variants. The UK is currently at number 8 position, having analysed more than 7.4% of the total cases. Co-presented by Skoda. Simply clever. Beyond World is One is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news updates on the move.